the lady that we see in the video was injured by a stroke. The brain was damaged by an hemorrhage. The central nervous system was so severe injured that half of the body was paralyzed. The patient is sustained. It's impossible to stand up for her. She's carried with a wheelchair. The hip and the knee are retracted. We can see the drop foot. The foot is equinus. The foot is inward oriented. It's varus. The passion puts the lateral aspect of the foot on the ground. This position does not allow the weight bearing neither the gait. It, it is an extremely unstable and painful condition. She cannot walk. This young lady survived the stroke. She did regain her consciousness and her feelings, but now her life is miserable. Her life depends completely upon others. She cannot walk, cannot use the bathroom, she cannot serve herself a glass of water. She needs help to go to bed and to sit on a wheelchair. As a wife and a mother, her condition is humiliating. How many years is she supposed to live? Rehabilitation and physiotherapies are useless in this case. Botulin toxin, relaxed spastic muscle for just a month and then the situation remained the same. The only thing to do is, is the operation. After the operation, the lady is able to walk along with a crutch. She does not use the wheelchair anymore. She goes out for a walk or shopping with her friends alone. The hip and the knee are relaxed. The left leg does not appear shorter than the right. The foot does not drop anymore. The sole of the foot stands firmly on the ground. Yes, an orthotics within the foot would have been possible, but the patient is not walking barefoot. It is true that foot does not drop anymore. The sole of the foot stands firmly on the ground, does not drop foot anymore, and no risk to fall on the uneven ground. The patient is not back to her precious life but attain a certain independence. She is not to be considered an hopeless crippled invalid. Just a wait for a family and a community.